So, <clears throat> are we ready? Yep. You were like, yeah. I thought you you had a question or something. No, it was like a go. It was a Q. Okay. Go. <laughs> You're supposed to do a, do a five, four. Ah, uh, okay, 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 right, right. All right. So, last time, um, where did we uh, start off? Yeah, last time. Um, what was that? Did someone join? No, I think someone Is joined someone the, the stream, maybe. Oh, okay. Hmm. I have the stream muted. All right. So last time you guys uh, started off with uh, Stemat in front of a guy, hooded, dagger in the end, blood bead, with an, a dwarf. Uh, seemingly get dead on the floor. Uh, the hooded person uh, just bamf out, started running in the forest. Uh, Semat started uh, running after him, waking everyone up uh, and like a poor, a poor suit um, followed with everyone trying their best to catch up, uh, throw spells, uh, like um, wind the person down uh, eventually it came to a close where uh, the guy just stopped standing like very like look looking withered and hurt with the dagger in his hand and he just slit his own throat um you guys rushed all over semat coming a bit later um he, you healed him uh, so that he wouldn't die and then brought him back to the camp in Manacle. Um, and that's pretty much like the whole session. The combat uh, was longer to do than it was to describe it. So you guys went back to camp with uh, the, the intruder in Manacle. You you uh, realize that Gerdon was actually dead, uh, killed with in one hit uh, on the spot by a deadly um, kind of sneak attack. And uh, you guys finished your long rest, thanks to Tamara that uh, were able to be fully recovered in the small short time that you guys had. So she kept watch for a full eight hours after that um so you guys are just waking up in the morning uh it is late morning because like uh you guys uh, maybe you went back to sleep at like two two ish three in the morning so you're waking up at like 11 which is very unusual for a, a gang of adventure like you guys so, um, yeah, that's where we left off. What do you guys want to do in the wake so, of the morning? So the guy is alive? Uh, yeah, you guys just left him by a tree. Uh, you were keeping oh. watch uh, okay. all night. He's still um, seemingly kind of sleeping, not seeing anything uh, under the tree. Hood up. Okay. Oh, really? Should ask him some question. Yeah, we have to prepare the interrogation. Interrogation. Yeah, so... I'll get the interrogators ready. <laughs> so. All right. So, as you guys make your way uh, toward the guy, um. The, the hood falls off, and you, uh, you hear a voice. Hey, guys! Oh, um, I'm a bit confused of what happened yesterday. Um, could you remove those for me? And at this point, you see it's uh, Toblin that is in Manacle talking to you guys. I don't know who Toblin is, but can he be a werewolf? Is that a thing? 
Was there a full moon? Oh my god. Okay. Toblin, Toblin actually is the innkeeper of Fendelin. And he's like a a friend. It's, it's a really good guy with a really good intentions and he helped us a lot. And what is happening? <laughs> okay, so last night we don't really see clearly what was the guy. If uh, if it was human or a creature. I think he had no it was a bit more creature like. You, you can remember clearly, like yesterday was kind of a blue skin. Uh, long nails, like uh, weird humanoid, not too like, not seemingly human. Like you guys tried to analyze, you weren't too sure what kind of creature it was. Okay, we okay. we all we all see what it was last night, and this morning, it's Doblin. Doblin, we have some questions for you. Yeah, yeah, sure. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll try to answer them, but yeah, my, my mind is very fuzzy right now. Would, would be very nice if you guys could remove these. Uh, we should. <laughs> Just wait a second. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to try to pull a character sheet that is not mine. <laughs> Again. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should. We should really get that fixed. It's not, if I'm gonna play more. Uh, yeah. Sure. Uh, Where's that dwarf? Bike <laughs> anymore? Where's, where's that dwarf at? Where's that dwarf? He would have all his spells. Okay, I have to. All his spells yep. are good. Okay. Uh, you could also decide to prepare a different spell during your. No, no, it's fine. I have a uh, detect magic, so I'm yeah, gonna. Yeah, that's what. That, all right, go ahead. I'm gonna uh, run yeah. detect yeah. magic. Well, Simat is gonna pop a detect magic. Um, I don't remember. Okay. Question: If it's a ritual, does does it cost does it a show? slot spell or so? If it is prepared, you can cast it and use a spell slot, and it's instant. If you cast it as a ritual, it doesn't use a spell slot, but it's like 10 minutes or something. Mm. All right, uh, give me 10 minutes. Okay. He's, uh, like, uh, he's going to prepare it as a ritual to keep his... Uh... So while this is happening, Tolin, what is the last thing you remember? Uh, I, I was... I was in in my inn I was serving serving people and then and then I went to bed okay were there anyone on yes, I, <laughs> oh. I went to I went to see if if oh, where is my dice if uh oh, my dice if I notice if he's lying, maybe he's the creature and he's uh, yeah, that's what I another form. Yeah. But right. I want to make an inside check. <laughs> Don't believe him. Shit. Uh, it was Doblin all along. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, ten? No. Eight? Oh, wait. Yeah. Ten. Um, it looks like Doblin. It's <laughs> you, 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 you. You don't really spot any uh, like telltales that would trigger anything that makes you feel like uh, he's lying or uh, trying to deceive you. Okay, I I see if he have a. Uh marks of hit or something like i don't know uh, mm. how do you say that if it like looks he looks bruised. like because i remember we hit him oh, yeah. 
for uh, I mean he was basically dead yeah he died yeah exactly so <laughs> he's looking rough or how he looks uh, like he just woke up from a long make, a, make a perception check okay come on perception I don't come on, know. Come on, dice. <laughs> 15? Oh, 15. Um, he, he looks like a guy that slept in, like, on the ground in the forest. But, I mean, he got a long, a long rest like you guys. Uh, hey, but buddy. You, 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 uh, you don't notice, like, bruises or uh like blood or stuff like that I, I, there is a test i could do i have a silver coin in my pouch we could try and see if it if anything happens if i put it in his hand if i'm not wrong changelings don't like silver so i tried to do that and put the silver on the silver coin on his uh in his hands I don't know, anywhere I can see it. Or any type of monster, actually, it doesn't like silver. Does it work? Yeah, I, I wasn't <laughs> sure. Oh, I, okay. <laughs> I, I got that from Witcher. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm not sure it works like that in D&D. <laughs> I don't know, sure. too. Any silver sword's going to cut anything in half if you swing it hard enough. Mm -mm. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to put the coin on the in the Zant. So I'll see if it reacts or something, says all. If you see if he doesn't like it. Um, Ooh, it doesn't I, seem to react. do anything. But, all right, I'll take my coin back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So totally new. We, um, uh, we going to put you there. I'm not going to take out the manacles for the moment while um Semat finish his uh, ritual. Because we think something happened yesterday with you, Toblin. Yeah, you killed uh, someone. It, it, I'm going to stare at him. Uh, I, I killed someone? Probably. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, well, someone killed Gurdon. Who's Gurdon? I show him Gurdon. On his feet. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my. Did I do that? Uh, leave, leave the dead alone. I'll take care of it later. That's we good. Should, we, we, we registered. Um, uh, the, the, no, the, you the don't, guy? you don't have to register. Okay. You're dead. But we have I'll to. I'll take care of it. Maybe we have, we need information. Uh, no, I don't think I don't think we have like uh, animate dead or speak with the dead or something like that. No, we're not there yet. Calm down. Level four. That is like level level seven. <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, as as uh, my ritual uh, finish. Uh... Um. Because I'm I'm trying to figure it out if he maybe change his body. Mm -hmm. Maybe he maybe he is stolen, or maybe not. <laughs> well, if you guys are done, uh, just waiting for the spell to finish. Yeah. Uh, so. Uh, Semat finishes ritual, um, shouting at Cade, leaving the body uh, along while he's doing that, losing a couple of minutes, uh, <laughs> putting back his mind into it. Um, and you finish your spell, and it doesn't appear to shine any magical aura from. Well, I mean the the dagger. I think uh, Juliana, you took the dagger. I think yes. Uh, Ooh, I took the dagger. Hmm. The dagger uh, is magical. I 
actually no. Oh. <laughs> I was uh no I I got confused sorry. So uh yeah no apart from like all of your guys' gears that uh, some of you have some magical stuff. Um, uh, you don't get any ping from the creature it itself. Nope, I got nothing. Now, uh, I'll take care of Curtin. And uh, so we... he walks. Uh, he walks off and go bury Curtin. Are the clothes that he's wearing the same as the creature we we captured? Can I try and comparing that? Um, or is he butt naked right now? So the make a yeah make a uh, investigation check. Investigation, let's go. It is 16 plus 4, 20! Nice. Uh, so y you you take a, mo a moment to just think and uh, redo kind of the scene and what happened uh, the day before in your mind. And you, you, you kind of now remember that... Uh, uh, Semat mentioned that the creature was hooded and then it flee into the, the forest. But the creature you f you found uh, like when he, he lit his throat and fall on the ground was pretty much lit naked. Uh, right. the, the, you, you, you didn't find any clothes on, on the creature. There wasn't clothes like around uh, really just the dagger on him. Uh, but Toblin right now is coded. Who has the dagger right now? Was it me? Did you? Did we try detect magic on the dagger? Uh, it would have popped on. Uh, yeah, well, your, uh, yeah, on okay. Right on, yeah. yeah. But, uh, but I already reconfirmed the dagger is no magic. <laughs> All right, it's so a very sh fine dagger, but uh, yeah, it's not magical. Okay. Boo. So well, if Toblin is. It's not naked. Well, I mean, for now, only um, only Zook realized that. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. share that information. I'm not sure how I'm going to RP it, but I want to share the information with a group. Good. So, so you're saying, I remember you're saying Zook any... is not naked. Mm. Zook is not naked, no. No, I'm not no. naked. No, not you. Toblin, you, Toblin is not naked. <laughs> <laughs> good observation. Good observation. I noticed something in my in my watch. If uh, the body moves or something, I noticed something weird. Uh, make a. Oh, there was an owl with her. Can can the owl roll as well? If it's in the watch. Um. Yeah. 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 We we can do a. a um... But uh, I'll have the owl, uh, the owl roll with disadvantage because he was more looking like around. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, but yeah. Tara was uh, kind of close and keeping uh, an eye. So you can roll a retroactive perception check. I don't really um, check. planned out before. Okay. Mm. 15 again. Okay. And. We're going to disadvantage nine. All right, nine. Um, he, like, um, uh, actually, you're okay. you don't really uh recall, like, the the this the 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 silhouette pretty much stayed like unmoving. Just like head down. Um, you don't really recall at what point it would kind of have like seemingly Change. having no clothes to being hooded again and uh, problem or underneath. Okay. 
So, let me recap. We're basically we're clueless to what happened. How how yeah. Toblin came here. And I'm worried. Someone, I don't know how how, how that can be. I don't know if it's maybe Dolin was the creature, but I don't think so. Or maybe someone changed the, yeah. the places. And maybe right now in the Toblin's house, there is a weird creature <laughs> that... Maybe they switched the place. That could make sense. Exactly. Maybe we should just uh, go again to Fendelin with the Tolin and check uh, mm. his room. Yeah. Pretty sure it's right. good old Tolin, but I... there was a, a switcheroo. Switcheroo. Should... I... It's... I'm, I'm a bit uh, at a loss here, but it seems a bit complicated to understand everything that's happening. Like, I, I, I fully understand if you guys want to, to, to keep those. I, I can't believe I I killed someone. That that's that's just awful. Well, we don't know if it was you because uh, yesterday we were chasing a blue creature, and we we get the creature here, and now in his place are you. So. Uh, I, I I don't want to say that it was you, Toblin, but we have to check this. It is suspicious. Yeah. There is another thing you want to tell us, Toblin? Like... Was there anyone... There is something weird that you feel... Weird at the end yesterday, or... What's your last memory? Do you remember? Where you were at? Uh, well, I, I just... I just told you guys. Um, I I just remember going like my normal day, like being at the inn and going to bed. And well, right now I feel like shit, like because I slept on the ground apparently. All right. Well, yeah, I I I understand your guys' concern, and uh, to be honest, I kind of don't trust myself right now. So if you want to keep keep me in in cough, it's it's fine. I'll I'll, I'll come I'll come along. Has something like this ever happened before? Well, no. But I'm just an innkeeper. I I have a very boring life. Are you it's... Are you sleepwalking sometimes? Ooh. Uh, I. I don't recall I, I actually I should ask my wife. Mm. But I Let's go ask her. Not, not that I I recall no. Are we far from Fandolin? Uh but I don't know. I think um I don't have row twenty. Open, we're close? You're... Or we're like a day walkish? Yeah. But it's already no, late. Remember, we we'll walk it. Ah, uh, yeah. Back home. But how he can walk? It, this is not make sense. It could be some spell or something for change places. I mean, well, at least last night was a full moon or something, like. A, I say that the the best people to tell us what happened would be people that were that were with him by that time. So maybe we can ask the wife, or if he was working at the end, we could check that out. Yeah. See, if somebody see was saw acting him. strange. Yeah. Because right now we need to know if we can trust him or not. Yeah. Yeah, I would. I would still. As because to Toblin has always been like a good friend. I would say. Except Except Zook doesn't trust him. Zook doesn't know him. We we could remove the manacles. Not sure he's gonna be able to actually 
run away. I'll go with the vote, but I, I'd keep I'd keep him tied. I wanna keep the manacles. At least, at least until we get to the ink. I don't know. Well, if it's a monster at night, we should kill him now. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I'm not displeased by that, that idea. No, 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 no. There, is less, there is less risk involved no. if we make sure. But maybe, maybe if uh, maybe Tolin is just uh, how do you say that? Like a trap? A victim. Yeah. Or maybe Tolin transforms transforms in a creature and he don't know. <laughs> but a, I think he still killed your friend in that perspective. I in I mean, we should we should keep him alive. For the moment, until we end the investigation. Okay then. We we Alive gonna... and shackled. Yeah. We're gonna know for sure that it was Toblin in the tent last night, or that we chase. We don't know. I'll go Maybe with the group. Maybe he transforms on that. like the like the lichens. <laughs> I don't know. So we go we go back to Fendelin in manacles, <laughs> just to be sure. Yeah. Okay. If it's someone else, it's just a... Uh... It's normal. Yeah. <laughs> so, Toblin? We have a big day of walking ahead of us. But you'll understand that... And I'm really that. sorry we'll, for the yeah, manacles. We'll, we'll keep the manacles, just... Just... Oh, everything's kind of weird right now. Yeah. No, I, I understand that. Um, do we have any... Do we have a car? Do we have... No, a, we don't have a car. Oh, we have to... We're, we're car to list. Oh, we, yeah. have, we have to walk, yes. Mm. Well... Oh, it's... Gonna well, be um, we're, we're gonna have to uh, ask the wife if he, if he likes it being in manacles. <laughs> <laughs> I Zoop doesn't get that reference and he's gonna just stare at Fern. Yeah, it wasn't mm. Fern, it was him at bottom. Yeah. Come on, that was my, my dwarf voice. Come on. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I think on that. <laughs> <laughs> if I have awkward uh, jokes jokes to say, it's gonna be here from Sema. Okay, I'll remember like, that. Uh, most of the time. and his jokes. <laughs> so, so the plan right now is we're gonna walk to the uh, the inn, to the village? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Just keep walking, just keep walking, just keep walking, walking, walking. What do we walk? Right. We walk! So you guys uh, start your journey. Um, the road is wide. You, you guys don't need a walking order. Um, how are you kind of, like, are, what are you guys doing? Just keeping watch outside? Do you put any preca precaution around Dublin? Like, how are, are you guys uh, setting this march? I'm going to go close to Toblin and I'm going to keep watch for everything. I'll be uh, no wait, <clears throat> wrong character. Uh, I'll be I'll be <laughs> I'll be in the front. Uh, front front. I'll open the march, and uh, I'm gonna be in the back, giving an nice. eye out. I'm uh, I'm slower, so I'm gonna stay in front of the dwarf. But I'm gonna keep the owl ahead of a, of a group as far as I can, just to check if something uh, something could pop off. Pop off. Sorry. So, so the owl the owl is ahead. Yeah. Um, we have Tamara and uh. I'm behind Toblin. Really, really close. Okay. I'm gonna be beside Toblin too. Sounds good. He's surrounded. I'm not going to make the same mistake last night. <laughs> so like you're 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 right next to Tamara and a, a bit like walking just uh, beside no not beside but behind Tamara. Yep. Okay. And then Samat is at the back, and um, and Zook, you're yeah I'm between Samat and uh, and Tamara. Toblin? Got Toblin? Is that not his name? Yeah, yeah, it's just that. Uh, so you have Toblin, 
and then yeah. Kid and Tom are kind of following him, and then yeah. you have Simat closing the Marl show. If oh you're, okay, you're, well I'm, I'm right. In front. Yeah okay yeah I get it, but I'm uh, I'm trying to not close the march, so I'm I stay in front of Semat, basically. So in between the uh, yeah that's the, it the small group and some, that's it with the owl that patrols. That's ahead yeah. Sounds good. Um, all right, so whoever is keeping watch, go ahead and roll uh, a perception check for <laughs> what was that. Searching my eyes. Come on. Like perception. <laughs> uh, we're gonna do it for for the whole the whole walk. Okay. okay. Uh, I'm going back to uh, to Fendelin, and you guys are pretty much gonna arrive at like around uh, sundown. Oh wait, guys! Oh wait, 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 wait! I'm gonna what? touch every single one of you. Don't mind me. Guidance, 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 guidance. <laughs> well, those... guidance is, uh, like, is, because we're doing a perception roll for a whole walk. So, like, guidance is more of a, like, Aww. instant <laughs> thing. Like, Aww. as of right now. Okay, yeah. Okay, but, uh, but I have an IT. I'm still gonna touch you all. Yeah, I'm gonna <laughs> roll. Shoo! It's an advantage for the owl. Owl got twelve. Well, the yeah, the owl eighteen. Why? Why are you rolling with the advantage? Advantage. Oh, advantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I Zook got eighteen. The owl got twelve. Owl's not rolling too good today. He's not. It's his first roll. He's not. He's not been rolling well since the. Beginning yeah, I mean it was one awkward. At I, I, one point he did good. I might have to switch it up at some point and kill him and get another one. Uh, she's <laughs> going to shuffle. die. It's perception, right? I roll a nineteen. Do we all roll? Everybody don't rolls. have a plus. Have a plus. Tamara. Yes, I, I, I. Uh... Was a 15 and plus 4. Oh, okay. Because you said I rolled a 19, so I, I thought you. Roll a 15. Okay. Plus 4 cents. That was perception. Uh, yes. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what? 19. Oh, wow. Fern, how much did you have? 9? Fern? No, Fern at a 5. Uh huh. Uh, wait, Semat, I don't know. Perception? Oh, he's good on perception. Oh. He is. Eight. Alright, so let not Mr. Alex roll any critical roll for tonight. <laughs> Semat got an eight? Yep, three. Oh. Plus five. Three, nine. Well, it's not as bad as my two natural one that got me killed in a row on my dead save. Oh. Um. All right. So, you guys uh, start walking. Um, the sun is up. Uh, it is a hot day. Um, but uh, Tamara, Cade are keeping a keen eye. Cade having a blast, like when there's light, actual things that you can <laughs> see for once. Uh, like <laughs> very keeping an eye like uh, a bird like start flying and notice it Shoot right it. away um Where? and also keeping a watch on uh toblin um he's not walking super fast uh you guys uh, kind of have to push him um not push him like literally but just like try to get close and uh, walk faster to just entice him to go a bit faster. Uh, but other than that, like you, you don't notice any uh, threat uh, around on your path, um, and you don't notice any unusual things uh, that Goblin trying to do. And you guys 
finally end up in Pendulum um, at around sundown, like I said. I put um, some kind of blanket or something in the manacles, the tolling, or the people doesn't notice because I don't want to. The people start talking because it, we don't know anything, it's so I just sundown. put uh, that. Well, let's well, go. Let's go. What is the hour? Yes. Time for a beer. Is it day? Is it still uh, daytime? Um. Uh, no, sorry. <laughs> no, it, I, you it, guys, you guys arrive at Fandalin at sundown. At sundown. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. It, it's get it's getting dark. Um, you guys enter the town. Your new friend with you, and a seemingly uh, confused Tablet. Have have we lost Copper along the way, or is he still here? Oh, what happened with Copper? Uh, I, I think he's still trapped to you, Simat's back. Okay, good to know. <laughs> so. Samad is gonna roll like a investigation check. To make on sure that he's alive. Yeah, if he's there. If he's there, trapped to his back. Yeah, because we take the the goblin uh, tied in the back of Samad, oh, okay. like a like a backpack. backpack. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, no, we we haven't lost him. He's still with us. Ah, okay. I keep feeding him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I rolled over ten, so I assume like I didn't. Like he's him. there. Yeah. He's is there. He, is he like he... your pet goblin? Is that yeah, what's happening? Pretty much. That, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Pretty much. Just checking. All right. He, he, he was. Yeah, we are he a was, weird person. He was there when uh, you guys uh, you met the group. <laughs> He yeah. was hiding in uh, in the bush. There was Gurdon and the Goblin, two NPC with with the rest of the group. Um, you lost Gurdon. You still have the Goblin for now. Okay. That's a shame. <laughs> <laughs> when we entered the thing, uh, I yeah, went to maybe maybe don't go with Goblin right away. Uh, no, no. Uh, go go and see if they lost uh, lost an innkeeper. <laughs> Who am I? Fern. Maybe it's Hopes. Oh, uh, is, 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 some, is something, is someone like, oh, what is Tolin or something like that? When we get to the. Wait, I, where, uh, so, what are you guys doing? We go to the inn. We enter to the inn. But no, so we everyone... don't enter the inn. Yeah, it's confusing. Like, what are you guys doing? Okay, Wait, we're it, going to enter I, or not? Some I of say, us. I say, are... yeah, two of us stay outside and check. The captive I'll, and I'll... Uh, some, yeah, and some of you go inside and investigate what what happened and see. Yeah, uh, because if we come inside with him, if there is an imposter, he's gonna see us coming, right? Okay. Well, uh, Tamara and I are gonna go see. Okay. I'm gonna keep watch on. Uh, and Semat. Yeah. You guys stay stay like on the Prisoner. on the side of the uh, the inn, try not to be seen. And we'll go in. The so Tolin is going to stay outside too. Yes. Okay. So okay. That's the plan. Mm -hmm. Okay. Took. Okay. There you go. Are we going directly to the room? All right. No, to the inn. So you enter the inn. Um, you you can quickly scan the room, make a perception check. Ten. That's not good. Mm -hmm. Ten. Ten. Eight. <laughs> All right. It's a mat. Is it dark? Oh, fern. <laughs> yeah, it's a mat. It's a mat well, and fern. And well, I suggest that Semat enter too. Fern, Semat, and me. Yeah, it's me and Kate outside, right? Yeah. yeah. Sure. So, did you roll? Oh, I thought. Okay. Because I, thought, I oh, must have a high perception. Right. 
Who's no, going I, in? I left. I left Samad out. You left Samad? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I did say Tamara Samad and I. I okay. being first. Samad south. Okay. Okay. So um, N. All right. So, uh, so it's Tamara and Fern. 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 And Fern. No, Fern. Samad is also. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So eight and ten. All right. So you guys just um, like you know what you're you're doing. You open the door. You're just scanning through. Um, it's getting dark, so people are coming in, and there is quite a bit uh, of people. Uh, you do a, a full swipe. You don't notice uh, Toblin uh, right away. Um, there is uh, apparently is uh, um, is sun at the counter. Um, but you don't you don't see Toblin like right away. Mm. Okay, I'll go at the counter. Uh, uh, tell me, uh, boy. Have uh, oh. have you lost a uh, innkeep? You mean what? You you mean my dad? Well, he, he's the innkeep technically, so yeah. I I, you're fern, right? You 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 guys are famous now in in the village. Yes. I uh, wait, wait. Uh, I'll, I'll get my dad, and uh, he goes uh, in the back store. Dublin, there's people for you, your friends. And we're gonna pose here. <laughs> <laughs> and outside. Oh uh, fuck! As Tamara and Simat uh, Fern opens the door. Fern, Tamara and Fern opens the door. Um, <clears throat> how are you guys like set up? No, oh, it's a kill circle. Tall is <laughs> inside, and we're uh, surrounding him. Nice, nice. Yeah. Right now that you know. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, I mean, no, because Zoop, we said Zoop we said first like anyway, uh, so. Yeah. And we said like they going to watch a Toblin because yeah. that's our target. So I think have sense that this uh how do you call it? <laughs> a pet circle. A yes. kill circle. Uh, no, yeah. it's from the crew. It's a family kill circle. Basically okay. you there's one in the middle and everybody else is around and uh, protects them. Right. We'll kill them. Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm -hmm. So um so, uh, Toblin, Toblin is just, uh, gonna, like, his face just change as soon as, like, the door closes. Uh, he, he has, like, a, an expression of anger, and he's just gonna quickly try and have a swipe at the closest person. So, I'm gonna just roll to see, uh, who he's gonna, uh, hit, um, and... I won't give him a, a, a like a surprise round because you're all looking at it. So mm -hmm. we're just gonna go ahead and uh, roll initiative at that point. Okay. So uh, I'll I'll roll. I should have should have been quicker on that one. As soon yeah. as I said, I'll go get my dad, I should have said like, out. I run out. outside. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I thought about it, but then. It's fine. Killing the village. So, my um, it's gonna be. Well, I mean, we're gonna roll initiative, and then uh, I can figure out who is gonna hit on his uh, turn. Okay. We uh, Fern and and I can uh, roll too, <laughs> because we uh, know something is happening. So. Well, it, it's like I said. It's as soon as the door closes. So. Yeah. Oh, uh, they okay. Have so like yeah. A, at least a turn, I would say. Yeah. My what is this? You roll badly. Uh, so far I haven't rolled like anything above. Uh, seven. that's a one. <laughs> oh shit. Hmm. Yeah. With a one, I go after everyone in the tavern and one in the inn oh, and one in the village. I got uh, eighteen. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Going up, man. So, uh, Zook, what's your total? Oh, oh, initiative? Yeah. Yeah, it's one. Plus, you don't have oh, no, uh, plus one. Yeah, you're right. So it's two. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. I, it's that fun. Yeah, that's it. I forgot okay. plus one. I just doubled uh, my roll. Okay. And then seven. Four. Four. <laughs> plus. <laughs> minus one actually, so five huh? minus one. Four. Oh wow. All right. So um. So like the the door closes. There's a bit pa uh, of a pause. You guys are but, like all watching him. Yes. But I, I have a question. He's with the manacle, so he cannot do something. Well, uh, I can do question. a lot of things with manacle, but you don't yeah. know. You don't know. It's not okay, Dublin. Okay. Well, okay. Just continue. <laughs> all right. So uh, there's a pause. You guys are watching him. And he, like I said, like the expression changes. He looks very angry, like feet out, and he's just gonna use it, the manacle and just slam. I forgot to roll to see. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, actually, as soon as he makes a move, Cade, that was the most uh, not trusting <laughs> and ready to kill, just notice it and. Yeah, instantly make a move. So, uh, kid, you're in the first to go. Oh, noise. Cool. Kill that bitch. Okay, we trust you. Since we're close, does it count like a sneak last attack? game? You, last game, you didn't run the forest. <laughs> now you can show yourself <laughs> your, your color. <laughs> Show us where you shine. <laughs> but, but we kept him alive, so uh, I guess I'm just gonna attack him. All right, so you're very close right now. Yeah. Um, I would say all you guys are like standing right next to him. So depending how you're attacking, um, range attack in close quarter will have disadvantage. So if I attack with my uh, rapier, I'm okay? You, you can, yeah. Okay. Poking with the pointy end. Yup. <laughs> and that's... 15 to hit. Uh, yeah, that hits. Nice. Yeah. And you have Does he know attack. I'm there? I have sneak attack? For real? Yeah, because um, everyone is around, so you have technically uh, allies that are engaged uh, with him. Oh, yeah. Seventeen. Dang. Dang. Quick math. 1d8 plus 3 plus 2d6. Pain. Is he nice. dead? Do we have to revive him again? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. No, he's not dead. Um, Alright. So, uh, Cade's reacting very quickly. Uh, dry sword. <laughs> And uh, like, just uh, pierce the guy in the flank. Uh, there's blood pouring out. Um, he's still standing though. What so color is gonna... the blood? Yeah, what color is the blood? Good question. You want me to do a quick search? Sure. Ah, uh, no. No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, we can look when when he's dead. When yeah. he's dead, we're gonna check his body. I mean. Yeah, we're going to check it. But it is why... a good question, though. It is because because he would be a changeling, maybe. Yeah, but how he changed? It's not a it's, it's not a spell. So what it is? Uh, it, I mean, I think it's a creature. I would just say uh, it is in in color. in the in the dark. It's very hard to tell in the midst of the combat and all that. Mm. But it looks very dark. And okay. More than blood should be. Um. All right. 
So, how do I choose? Doesn't work with a D6 because I have three targets. Well, oh, if you did one, two, three, yeah. four, five, six. Yeah, that's it. Just do pairs. One of them has more chances. But anyway. So one, two is going to be decayed. Uh, three, four. Oh, no. You're right. <laughs> that makes sense? I don't know why. Six yeah, divided why. by three. <laughs> there's two chances each. <laughs> that, was, that was great. Uh, don't worry. So, um, Zook is going to be uh, three and four, and then some up the rest. Got four, so Zook is just oh, no. uh, slamming you. You don't have a, a, a chance to just move away. You you get surprised, and it's gonna be uh, where is this? What? Oh, okay. So, uh, he's gonna... 16 to hit. Zoop. Is that me? Yeah, oh, okay. Well, I wasn't sure. I didn't hear my name. Sorry. This is 16. I'm supposed to roll my... Is it armor class, you mean? Yep. Yes. Oh, yeah. Against... Yeah, 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 you hit it. That, that's, that's 11. Yeah, there's no... Uh, yeah. Right. I'm oh, I'm a wizard. We didn't give you the That's ten stuff. Be... Yeah. Yeah, I have zero of the weapons that you guys have. Oh, we're gonna have to check these out afterward. So that's gonna be uh, eight damage. Oh. Yeah. And he has uh, two attacks. Eight so... unarmed. Damn yep. son. Jesus, he's he, buffed. He, he, he's doing slam attack. Okay. Ah. Attack. Oh. Oh, that's a natural one for the second attack. Woo! So, <laughs> so yeah, yeah. Um, he, like, uh, everything is unraveling. He just makes a move, attack you, and then goes for another blow. And, like, Kid just react and, like, <laughs> purses bang. So, uh, he kind of missed the second attack uh, on you. Um, and next up is Semat. Yeah! So Matt has spells. He's gonna use... Yes, he has spells. <laughs> A guiding bolt! Alright. Yeah. Um, First level. Guiding bolt. Is that a... a it's a... It's an instant it's attack. A spell range attack, right? Uh, I don't know if yes. spells. Does spell range attack work as a range attack? Like you? Oh, you. Wait. Good question. The range attack of five feet. Range spell attack. Mm -hmm. That doesn't fit. Close range. Mechanic. If it's a range spell attack, yep, you get disadvantage. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. If you are too close. So if, if that's if that's what you're doing, uh, you're gonna have disadvantage on your attack. Uh, I have nothing else prepared that is actually like a, a touch. So. Except guidance. And spare the dying. Oh, that works too. 
spare the dying? Is spare the dying. Spare. Uh, no, it's no. Stabilize. I'll, uh... Stabilize uh, someone that is uh, unconscious. I'll try a guiding bolt. Yeah, safe. Yeah. Go for it. Hopefully. With with your strike, your uh, strike of roll this evening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. gonna be. Uh, fourteen to hit. That just hits. Yeah. Yeah. La it was a level one. It's forty. So that's a nine points of damage plus. Games in. That's 21 points of damage. Jesus. And next one who attacks him has advantage. And that would be Zook. Yeah. I think it's yes. a weapon uh, attack, though. Yeah. Uh, is it? I don't remember. And the next attack roll made against this target before the end turn has advantage. No, it's just attack, attack roll. roll. Doesn't, have to be, doesn't have to be melee on range mm -mm. or range, but I mean, if <laughs> advantage doesn't mean anything if it's not an attack roll. Um. <laughs> uh, all right. So, so Semat clenches like all his symbols. Make a, 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 a ball of energy appear. Go to uh, the guy. He he kinds of like stiff a bit and it seems to be very very like uh uh painful but um more than standing. it should be and uh not really okay yeah. hey. i don't know i think it's a uh, radiant is it radiant that is where, where is it though? yeah radiant man no but okay. no okay it was just 21 uh, hit point yeah, okay. that, that that that's gonna that's yeah, that's gonna good. hurt. That's good enough, I feel. <laughs> and uh, he's looking at Semat very very angry. And at this point, like it, it's almost um, uh, it's not Toblin anymore, and it's kind of reverting back to the uh, initial uh, shape that you saw in the woods earlier. Um. All right. So Zook, you're up. Yep. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna destroy him. He's 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 uh he's about 15 feet away from me. Is We're he? not going to interrogate anyone. Yeah, there is no interrogation right now. That's <laughs> not what Zuka has planned right now. I wanted to kill him. I that was open to the idea. Uh, is he close? <laughs> you are all like right yeah, next to him. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's perfect. That's that's um, that's excellent. Um, I'm gonna go with Burning Ants, so Dexterity, he has to roll for Dexterity of 14. Before See? you do that, um, mm -hmm. I'll have you roll to know which angle you are. Like, uh, are you facing the, I, the, uh, the, um... The inn? The inn, or facing, like, more of a, a, a wide space. Okay, because I don't mind, I don't mind so, that. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. What am I rolling so for if, that? Roll a d6. If you're uh, one to three, you are facing uh, the. Um, well, actually, roll a d4. D4. And okay. like, it would be all the the cardinal uh, okay. direction. I'm gonna so roll like a d4, and one, you, you let me know. One is uh, the in, and two is there. Three is behind and you're good, and um, uh, four is kind of the other side. Okay, so basically, if I roll a one, it's dangerous for people inside the end. Yes. All right, let's check your data out. It's a four. Nice. Well, I mean, four is. Uh, you're probably gonna hit a bit of the uh, the in with the angle. Okay. But, um, uh, yeah, it's not going to be as bad as like putting the whole thing on fire. All right, that's good. Um, he has to do play dexterity though. He can save right. dexterity fourteen. Dear God, please tell me it doesn't hit the hits. That's a 
18 plus 4. Jesus! So that's uh, 22. So it does dodge. Alright. Is it no damage on a dodge? That's what I'm looking. It's, it's a can it's a cantrip or it's a one level spell? It's a one level for a spell. But it should be half damage, I think. Dexterity well, saving throw. Uh a, a creature takes three D six fire damage on a failed save or half as much damage on the successful one. So it is half damage. Yep. So you can roll damage. Yeah. I assume you protect um Yeah, evocation, fine. so I always I and anyone that's in the group's not gonna hit, get it. Don't worry okay. guys. I got you. How many all. target can you do again? It's three plus one. Uh, it's like the level. It, yeah, it's level is it level two plus the number one uh, just give me one sec. Plus one the spell level. So there's only two right now that I don't want to hit, so it's fine because level it's level one. And I can choose two targets that will not receive any kind of damage. Right. And, and I roll thirteen. Which is damage? Yeah, half. so but you need you need to do half of that, so I'm gonna hit you and you handle that. <laughs> Sorry? I but it's six point five, so I'll let you choose. Uh, yeah, I'd say seven. Also. No, no, it's always rounded down, so it's it's six. 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 Um, I just want to check something quick. What's your feat? Protect people. What's the uh, to protect? Yeah. Um, sculpt spells. I have the description right here. When you cast an invocation spell that affect other creatures that you can see, you can choose a number of them equal to plus one the spell level. The chosen creature automatically succeed on their saving throws against the spell and they take no damage. Okay. They would normally take half damage on ex if they it kind of cuts off. Oh, they take no damage if they would normally take half damage on successful save. Okay, good. That's the part I wasn't sure. Yeah, it's very, it's very strong. It really is, because, you, you know, the meme about the fireball in a cave, like, yeah. everyone know that, so... No, the, the second I saw that we started level 4, I was like, oh, I need to scope spell, clearly. Good. <laughs> uh, so that's 6 damage to him. Uh, was in, uh, right. So at that point, like, it, it's just, it, He's still standing. He's fully back to, like, this kind of uh, just muscle uh, shape, very thin, uh, no clothes, no hair, looking at you guys very angry, with like teeth and uh, claws out. Um, so it's kind of this picture of like fire <laughs> everywhere and this silhouette dark inside it um, that is just uh, withstanding the, the fire uh, as of now. Um, and there's bits of the the inn that is kind of catching fire a bit. So you guys probably have to deal with that right after. But fire! Um, that's it for you, Zook. Uh, yeah. Can I uh, can I put my owl to attack him? Kind of fend on him. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So can I'd you like to... can you uh yeah I forgot to make you roll initiative for oh your damn or, oh, yeah. or or um I don't it's fine familiar right your your oh yeah 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 I don't know how the spell work if you want him to attack is it on like, uh, no it says he, he acts independently so okay. he would have to roll initiative also I just completely forgot about it. Okay. Uh, yeah, just go ahead and, and roll. Yeah. Um, um, so it's a regular attack. What do I need to hit? Uh, I, well, roll initiative for now. Oh, okay. For him? First. And yeah. so I can put it just uh, give me in a second. order. Just give me uh, second. But it's probably going to... Like, since we're starting a new round, I'll let, oh, you, wow. I'll yeah. let you go. Yeah, uh, that's, a, that's a five for him. Okay. <laughs> 
initiative is not very good with me tonight. So, uh, yeah, you can do his round. Okay, so he's just gonna go straight for him and try to claw him. Sounds good. Which means it's a melee weapon attack plus three. Can't see because it's behind my. Oh, that's a six. So I'm going to go ahead and say it doesn't hit. What's his armor class? Six, six total? Yeah, six total. That's that's all. I rolled a three, would seem. Okay. So uh, no, that, does, that doesn't hit. Okay. So, well, that's it. That's salt. So the, the owl just like plummet down, go Completely for the attack. Missing. But... At the same time, seemingly a, a wall of fire just is created, so he's just quick <laughs> turning around and uh, try next time. Nope. <laughs> All right. A, a bit of a bit of miscommunication uh, on that on that one. Uh -huh. uh, All right. So, yeah, okay. I, I added a reminder that you have an owl. Yeah, where's the owl? Why, why can't I see it anymore? Oh, there it is. He's just smaller. Yeah. Just put it on there. <laughs> Coo -coo. Yeah, that makes more nice. sense. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, Kate. You're up. I'm gonna attack him again with my rapier. Good work. Uh, 19 to hit. That hits. Let's go. Absolutely. Oh. 10 damage. Um. How do you want to do it? Kill the guy. Uh, <laughs> well, as he's trying to hit Zook again with the shackle, I'm just gonna stab him real good, and he's gonna fall to the ground. The best magic right there. Yeah. yeah. So as he's still standing in the fire, um going for another attack with Zook in his face, palm up, throwing fire at him. Um, Cade, seemingly untouched by the flame, just walks in the back. And for the two others uh, on the side, you, you like I said, you see the silhouette in the flame. And then the flame dissipates, and there's Cade that you didn't notice is behind. Uh, and the sword is just out in the front. The creature falls on the ground. Kade is behind uh, with his sword full of thick black blood. And everything went very fast. So and as come the, bursting uh, out of the inn. Guys, it's not Dublin! And... <laughs> it's just a, an explosion of fire. <laughs> I <clears throat> I see the, the 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 fire and I try to search some water inside to to we we're not going to burn the inn so <laughs> I right. so try to get the water uh, ring the alarm uh, uh, get uh, the attention of other like uh, patrons that are working um, people start. Like gathering uh, buckets, filling water, coming outside. They are very confused with like everything that just transpired, and uh, it, yeah. But like the urgency is to get the fire out, so they're just focusing on that. But um, yeah, it, it wasn't it wasn't hit too hard, uh, so it's not too difficult to get it out. While they're doing the water, is there a way for me to an analyze the body? 
trying to understand what it is. Now that it's not human, look like. Uh, Zoop doesn't I... really care about the fire that he started. <laughs> Check the body. So, um, well, I mean, are you? Um, so you right now he's unconscious. So, like he's uh, very quickly uh, like dying. Mm -hmm. So I, I I I don't know if uh, oh. you guys uh, like are are you still wanting to uh, kind of save him? Or uh, otherwise, like as this is transpiring, he's gonna be doing death save, and you guys know how, how good I am on death save. So, do, uh, uh, <clears throat> do we want to keep him alive, or uh, we just let him right. die? Right now, I'm not quite sure if we can communicate with this creature. He's just. Full of rage, and I don't know why. Zook's curious. He went. You like he wants to know. So I'm opting not to kill him and try and stabilize him. I'm curious. I want to know what he is. All right. Spare the dying. You wanted, yeah, you wanted to know what spare the dying, dude. There, there you go. There you go. <laughs> spare the dying. Right. You touch a living so. creature that has zero hit points. The creature becomes stables. The spells have no effect on undead or constructs. So while they are doing that, I'm going to try to tie him up more. Yeah, yeah that's the <laughs> point I was going to yeah. make. Yeah, like... Uh, I'll just put my knee... And a rope and everything. Fern, Fern is going to put a knee on his chest. So he's... Jesus. Okay. He's going to die. Down. Dying. Nah, not right. a knee. A foot. Yeah, a foot. Don't want to knee down. I'm going knee to down. ask questions right now. When he well, right now, wait. right now he is at zero. Mm -hmm. He is sta stabilized, but he's unconscious. Uh, so what are you guys doing? Like, uh, the f there's people getting, uh, like, taking care of the fire. That's pretty much like done and out. Uh, I have people gathering a bit, like looking at you guys, uh, wondering what's going on. Um, tomorrow you cannot. Uh... Heal him I'm, back I'm going up. to cast uh, cure wounds in the guy and to wake him up. Are we waking me up right now? Yeah. 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 If we yeah. Is, if we wait, uh, it's going to be for a long going rest. He's going to be full HP back. So. All right. All no, right let's no. wake him up. I'm going to cast cure wounds in the guy. All right. And this is it. And you tied him up, right? Yeah, and I'm going to can tie him really you hard. Describe how you tie him i'm going while well, well i i think semat is trying to stabilize the guy and for have <laughs> his pain in his chest i'm going to try to just hold his arms get really really close in his with his body like with the with the with the rope and i'm going to try to make a burrito <laughs> like, I was gonna. Okay, I was go. gonna say how you you tie up like a roast beef. Yeah, there you go. Like I, I shared a picture. That's... Like that. So and uh, he's going to receive. I mean, uh... sure, that works. <laughs> I don't know what you search, then... but it's a I, bit I kinkier than I literally. <laughs> yeah, I just typed arm tie it to leg, and that's the first one that popped off. I said, yeah, you know what? That's, that's good enough. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Fafoon is gonna doesn't... look at that and gonna be like, mm, what happened? What the, the hell? What's happening in their session? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's he doesn't have any clothes, so it's pretty accurate. Yeah, right, there you go. go. <laughs> See? <laughs> so he's going to receive seven points of uh, life. Right. And I'm. Um, and we go. So um, and we're he, going uh, to waken up, like. Psh, wake up. <laughs> we are tired of this game. <laughs> you have to say everything. <laughs> I mean, at the game to just chasing the guy and everything, <laughs> just clarifying the situation. 
Well, a. Uh, Who are you? Like, Who do you work for? Right now he's like he's kind of uh, face down in in the dirt. Um, are you guys staying in the road, like in the street, in front of the inn with people gathering and just starting uh, questioning him? Yes. I want to is, uh, it, paint my, paint the picture of what's going on. Is the inn still open, or is it too yeah. burned? Yeah. All the people okay, he's so, trying to. Well, I mean, it, it's it's all open, like. There was people in it, people were eating, they were drinking, and everything is happening very fast. So we need there's a room. People, there's people uh, coming out, uh, the the fire is controlled, uh, there's a bit of smoke, it's smelling a bit of smoke in, in the inn. People don't know really what's going on, uh, so it's a bit of a ruckus right now. Um, Sabat, Sabat, like, give me some uh, crowd control. Yeah, I'll go. And uh, he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna go around casting uh, prestigiation, doing little flares and make it saying like, "Move, people! Move!" All right, make a. I'll help him out because I also have prestigiation. Oh my god! But yeah, prestigiation. You have to say it. You have to say it quick. Prestigiation. Yeah. Uh, add a lot. Of a lot of spit in it. In your game. <laughs> uh, you wanted a what? A uh, performance? Uh, I was gonna say an uh, intimidation check. Same. Okay, it's 14. So. We're going to take the guy just in one, um, I don't know, in, in one street, like, uh, how do you say that? Like, a... <laughs> okay, like like Seven. somewhere we can uh, in a back alley. Questions. Sure. Yeah, back alley. Thank you. Yeah, I agree right. with that. So uh, just um, with with Semat and Zoop trying like to uh, spout out like fires and weird sound and pushing people. Uh, Zoop I'm going people to... like don't seem to. Uh, be really impressed with like the small gnome coming at them and just spreading stuff. But Semat with his uh, bigger like uh, uh, stance and just shouting and like raising his armor, uh, he he starts very quickly to just disperse the the crowd. There's people that stays more like in a distance and are looking from far. Uh, far behind but uh, other than that you're able to disperse uh people can, can we with... uh is there like a i'm gonna say a back alley but well i mean uh you're in the pretty much in the middle of the town the the houses are not like that close to each other so you you can just go in between two houses or in in the back of uh like sure. just behind one of those um find a, a dark dark alley or something yeah so you just spot. throw him on uh, the side of a, the wall of a na of a house and uh, I'm gonna go pee hey. oh, sure. <laughs> let's go all right be right back oh hey. oh no that food goblin. Yeah, goblin. Uh, copper, it's pretty much like a... What is it? Uh... Ruins us because he cost us coppers. He cost us and... Uh... <laughs> he didn't do nothing. And, and pocket bacon. I expensive <laughs> and very hard to come by pocket bacon. He's a useless pet. Yeah. It doesn't even bring us joy. Maybe one day. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe we need a, a trap or something. Like, a, a trap. how do you call a that? Tarnish? <laughs> a bait. Yeah, like a bait. A bait. Thank you. <laughs> that could well, be very useful. You needed him to go to the castle and he wasn't able to bring us there. Exactly. That was the point. So you right got, now we you can... got you guys in the general direction. Mm. Yeah. General. General. I don't know. All right. Um. All right. So you guys oh. are in the back alley. Um. 
the guy is tied up very well. Um, what are you guys doing? Talk, who are you? <laughs> nice. I was I was considering asking for him to break ribs, but you can smash his I mean it works. No, we need to talk. Talk. He he he's that who are you? Who or... do you work for? Make a make a, an intimidation check. <laughs> okay. Intimidation. Pen? Just spits on the ground at your feet. At, at your feet. Oh, motherfuck. Who are you? And, like, as he, uh... As he, like, kind of bows down his head and raises the, the head back, like, hair just grows and he looks at you guys and it's the face of Sildar. You're not gonna... You're not gonna hit me, Tamara. I can because I know you are not the... You are just a creature, an awful creature. Who are you? Uh, I'll kick him with a knee. But not, not in a... Not hurting way. I actually want to hit him with a knee. I want to roll an attack, kick right. him with my knee. Okay, go for it. <laughs> Are we gonna kill him again? He has yeah. seven eight point. I cannot kill him at all. He has seven points. Oh, he has seven health point. Really? Yeah, right it's... now? Fuck. Yeah. Oh, I, I have idea. All right. <laughs> I'm going uh, to heal it. Twenty one to hit. That hits. And it's uh, three points of bludgeoning. Oh, that's bad. You did damage to him? Yeah. Dude. Oh, I might kill him. All right. He kind of reverts back to this, uh, like, fleshy, muscular, no hair, blue kind of skin, uh, teeth out. He's just scrawling. Ha! All right. <clears throat> You're not gonna fool us anymore, so... Tell me, who do you work for? Guys are as dumb as you look. I'm going to kill this. All right, uh, Zoom's going to intervene because, like, clearly they need some help. I'm going to do acid splash on him and make him suffer as much as I can. It should not kill him, except if I roll exceptionally right. But I'm pretty sure some acid will, will, will make him talk. Okay. <laughs> um, what's the... what's acid splash? It's 1d6. I'm hoping I don't... Oh, you is mean... A, uh, you a mean dex save? Yeah, it's a dex save, 14. <laughs> But I mean, okay. he's not moving. Yeah, he's grappled, so he, he automatically. Uh, I, fails. I, I feel like I should be able to hit him right now on the ground. Yeah. So I really hope I don't kill him right now, but let's see. It's 1d6? Yeah. Oh, wow. All right. I, I'm, a, I'm good at medicine, also. I might be able to help. Uh, I rolled a 6. It's literally yeah, that, yeah, oh yeah, okay. So he's just like, the like Zook puts his hands out. You guys are like, don't burn the house! And, and it's like uh, poison this time, or like sludgy, yellowish, green stuff that comes out. Starts like melting his, uh, his flesh, and like in some places you can even start to see bones almost and like he's screaming an agonizing scream and um he just like the, the pain is so so uh painful that he, he just falls un unconscious one point like, just one point better dying I... yeah so no he doesn't have one point right because fern did damage to him yeah 
Oh, okay. Yeah, no, right now, he, he fell unconscious and the acid is still, like, uh, heating out, like, his flesh. And he... Spare the dying uh, works, no? Can I, yeah. uh... Can I uh, try and wake him up with medicine, or like how how would we wake him up? Because right now he's like damaged. The, the pain is not waking him up, right? You can't cast cure well, wounds again. What happened is he went unconscious again. Okay. Like below zero, and he was dying. Zemat so uh, used spare the dying again, mm -hmm. so he's stabilized at zero. Nothing okay. Needs to happen. So he can't um, die right now. No. Okay, that's good. So oh, you like can have... the, So, like, Simat, like, touch him, cast Spare the Dying, and I, it seems to kind of neutralize uh, the acid in All some right. magical way. And, like, the, the wounds are, like, disgusting. It's kind of, like, flesh, blue and dark, and in some places, like, you see, you see the bones, and uh, it's looking very rough. But at the same time, it, it did eat uh, the ropes so he's not oh, fighting oh fuck I didn't think of that, about that well okay. I'm pretty sure Zook didn't you didn't see that so so Tamara you can remove the ropes that you used in your inventory because it's just <laughs> my bad because I lost the rope no? but you guys can ask your question now I'm pretty sure he's ready to answer anything you're gonna ask him I was well, just getting well, impatient how we right now we he's have... unconscious oh okay yeah. I we have rolled. to wake him up. I can cast cure wounds again. <laughs> yeah, I do it. Yeah, that could work. Cure wound. <laughs> All right, so Tara and... again, kind of looking a bit. Seven a bit, points uh, again. How many? In fact, it's seven, eight, nine points. Nine, nice. Better than. than... Just one. two. So uh, Tamara just gives you a look, uh, Zook, and kneel down, puts her hands on uh, the body, which starts like healing the flesh, like coming back. Um, and he, <laughs> he's brought back to consciousness again. Welcome back. We can do this all night. So you're going to suffer. And I approve in the back and just see me laughing a little bit and just being intimidating. I'm not saying right. shit, I'm just looking at it. Uh, so, Zoom, so we... make a, a, another intimidation check. Yeah, with, yeah. With, with advantage if yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, it's because acid, right? What happened if I start breaking his, his, uh, <laughs> his fingers? fingers? <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm gonna give advantage to. Uh, all right. All right. Okay. So let me let me roll. First roll is a nine, so not great. And a nine again, double nine. Let's go. I'm rolling so bad, except when I don't need to roll high. It's amazing. Well, nine intimidation. Guess we have to kill him again. <laughs> I'm going nine, to. You don't, you, you don't have any bonuses. I, plus one. That's it. Ten. So it's so ten total. No, 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 no. It was eight, then nine. Okay. And I rolled eight twice, basically, and then I got plus one on both. Go and break his feet. <laughs> so, uh, so, as um, you're trying to intimidate him, uh, Zook, he looks at you. Oh, I can go all night too. Oh yes, I'm going to break his feet. I'm going to crush his uh, his feet right now. And try to break it. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but really each, time, each time we try to do with something with intimidation, normally the, the 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 DC goes up. It's harder and harder to intimidate. Is what is that what you're saying? Maybe. I mean, maybe, but he's covered in acid, and we're breaking limbs one after the other. I yeah. think it. I think it'd be the other way around. At some point, we have to mentally break the guy where he's like, oh, well, that's the fourth time that I died tonight. I'm missing one feet, one arm, and there's some acid splash. At some point, he has to be like, oh, I'm I'm done. Just need to keep going. You, you don't know the background. 
of the guy. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's, that's a point. agreed. Agreed. You're right. Do You're I have absolutely... to roll for attack? Sorry. I have to roll for attack, or? Yeah, you can. To okay. stump his feet. Yeah. Need to break his feet. <gasps> oh, uh, I have something good. That would be like. Fourteen. Your oh, wow. armor strike. Okay. Yep, that hits. Just and damage. Well, I don't know what is this damage. Uh, well, if damage. you stomp in, it's gonna be an unarmed attack. So I think you just roll it. It's in your attack. Oh, no, I'm I'm strike it your in there. Wait, <laughs> roll a d8. Uh, or an unarmed attack? Uh, I don't think so. Well, you here, it in is it, is it, okay, in is it nothing? It. Okay, because here I have no die to roll in damage, you say just one. Oh, it's it's one. just your strength mod, it's just your strength modifier. My strength modifier, oh. zero. That's good. But it's right in, just under it, unarmed strike, it's one plus strength modifier. One plus a strand modifier just so it's is one. one. Okay. And I'm All going right. to break his feet. Nice. One oh. feet. And I'm going for the next one. <laughs> Who are you? Yeah. What is your name? <laughs> Wait, give me give me one sec before you uh, you break the other one. Zook has a plan. But let's see if something happens now. But he's just at this point he's just screaming in pain. His feet is. Is he is he uh, talking in common? Yeah. Is he talking, like is he swearing or or it's always common? It's, mm. You can always hear him. Yeah. It, it, well. Uh, yeah, he's. Uh, I guess he's swearing. Uh, but yeah, no, he, he, he everything. Uh, that you heard him say was in hell. But who's ask? Did we ask any question to him? Or are we yeah, just am, killing am, a guy in the back alley? I no, am. No. Uh, am I asking? Who you, you are you? You asked him. You ask him. Uh, yeah, who, who he was and who he was working for. Okay. And he's still not answering. He's not answering. All right. Nope. I, I got the perfect. I'm going thing. to break the other one. <laughs> um. Oh. Do, 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 Fern. Do. Yeah. I'm going to yeah, yeah. break the other one. As as Simat, am yes. I able to like, discern what type of creature is this? Um. Yes. So, uh, I I think you guys tried to roll last time, but you mm -hmm. you can uh, try and. Uh, you saw a lot more. You saw it going from like bones back to normal. You saw it kind of uh, uh, like change working. form almost in, in, in front of you. So uh, I'll make you make another Arcana check. And I'll R touch history. myself. Our history. The yes. Arcana our history. Uh, uh, everyone? No, oh, me. 20. Uh, doesn't really matter. Well, I'm proficient in Arcana. Does it? Yeah, I'm also proficient in Arcana. I got Does it make six. anything? Uh, well, you add your proficiency bonus, so your bonus should be a bit higher, but it's a different stat. So, depending on your stat, it might be the exact same thing. Okay, no, it's a. Okay, okay. No, it already adds it. Because Arcana yeah. is int. <laughs> But it's a minus one, but proficiency is a plus two. Kind of weird. Yeah. Uh, uh, but I have guidance. So. Thirteen. Um. So, yeah, looking at it and with all like what transpired, uh, you're. Finally, kind of making two and two together, um, and you have a very good idea that this is a doppelganger. 
Ooh. A, a shapeshifter. Okay. Yeah, it, it, it's a change. Yeah, it's a changing. Wow, Zook is amazing. He called it like one day ago. <laughs> I'm going I to break his called it also last game. Yeah. But I don't think you guys, or maybe a few of you, noticed when he said it. But mm. yeah, I noticed he he said it. That. Yeah, it's a monstrosity uh, that can shape shift. All right. I break his feet. The oh, other feet. I roll wait, 15. wait. Before you do that, I got the ultimate intimidation technique. I think. Okay. So, I, so as as she's stomping the other foot. Oh fuck. You. You can. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Well, yeah. So there's one, there's one foot bleeding out, right? Like it's well, stumped. It, well, it's broken. Yeah, it's broken, like, and he was naked, right? Yes. All right. So I'm gonna get my owl to sit on it and start chewing. I'm gonna try to intimidate him by having my owl eating right now, getting some fresh meat. It has, All right. to, it has to, because he, he so deals, as... Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. So as um as Tamara is stomping on the other foot, uh, the Alex comes and start like chewing the foot. Uh, you can go ahead and make another intimidation check. Um, Come on, one one good roll. Is it advantage or not? Yeah, I'll give you advantage. You're both kind of. Uh, oh. Having a go at it. Wow. Uh, I saw these that. Are so, these are so bad. I keep rolling so bad. You, you need to uh, buy yourself a set of uh, dice. Yeah. My god. Well, my biggest one is 11. Oh. <laughs> and I, I don't know what kind of hit that is, but does say that the owl deal 1d1 of damage oh did you roll for damage Tamara? uh one because it was a bludgeoning damage oh yeah that's right okay so right and, now the guy the, is like the owl it's one let's say 1d1 1d1 yeah it's it's it literally what it says 1d1 but i know so weird. and no plus I, no plus nothing there's a there's a plus to to actually hit but the actual damage is 1d1 slashing damage that's it how do you roll a, a d1 i don't know i don't know i'm reading it out right now from like dnd fifth edition compendium now like oh yeah it's 1d1 it a... it's a really shitty owl that's what's yeah. happening right now all right um so he, he looks at you like in pain and kind of confused with like everything that's happening. Um, and you say, You guys, I completed my mission. You won't get anything out of me. I'm down to kill right now. Yeah, I don't think we can. Yeah, and like, he, he kind of like, start grinding his teeth, on, like he seems like very angry. Um, anyone else wants to try anything else? <laughs> What's uh? Wait, 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 wait. Hey, you got something, man? Come on, just <laughs> get the bastard. There has to be something. At least we know he can't run. Uh, we can the... we can kill them and cut his head, and then went to the necromancer and asked questions. Wait, isn't the... one of you against necromancers? Nec well, I can't uh, do this. <laughs> yeah, okay, the necromancer is dead, yeah. by the way. So... Um, no, but it's yeah. not just necromancer. Tamara was talking about um, speak, speak to dead. Speak, speak to, to dead. dead. But well, we have to know someone to know the spell. My... The Semat as speak to them? No idea. I don't know if it's just a. I don't remember. But isn't speak to dead necromancy? 
Mm, clerics can do that too. Oh, really? Okay. Okay, sorry. I didn't know that. It's probably necromancy, but a lot yeah. of cleric spells are actually necromancy. Necromancy, yeah. Wow. As, as the school of magic. Wow. Because necromancy is, is actually like life spells. Like it's playing with life and death. So. Uh, yeah, okay. Makes sense. Yeah. But they're level expelled, so. Um. Wait. With our with our the the scroll you guys got. <gasps> uh, Samad has most of them. And he can't access them. Uh. Scroll. Yeah, we get some scrolls. Have fireball. But uh, that's the only scroll I can see. In yeah. fact, it's the, it's the only one, yes. They don't have much. Oh wait, there's a spell scroll first level. I have two. I have no idea what it is. Just a scroll. What? Scroll. It doesn't see what it is? No. I have spell scroll first level. Could give it to me. Maybe I can read it out. <laughs> Maybe I have it in my notes now. Yeah, but it's gross. Or, and here's Zuka. We killed the dude. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's not going to say anything. Yeah. But I wonder, what can we do? Because right. right now, so I, I I found the loot back of when I gave you guys the 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 scrolls. Okay. One should be fireball. Yep. The other one should be charm person. <gasps> Ooh, that's useful to know. Yeah, yeah, I mean, after we splashed in an acid and then break both of his feet. <laughs> they might use that. Oh, wait, I just, I just thought of something. Uh, he's going to use charm. <laughs> but charm uh, I person. don't know if, I don't know if Cleric can use it. Uh, because oh. it has to be on your spell list. I'm pretty sure it's not on uh, Samat's spell list. I have a... Uh, nope, I, did, I don't... I mean, it, spell list, I mean the, the class spell list. Not actual okay. Samat spells. I'm just saying that the class needs to have it on, uh, on its list. For char person... The classes who have, to, who can use it is bards, druids, sorcerers, warlocks, and wizards. Yep. So we have a wizard. Yay! Yeah. Is, is it one of the things uh, we we were doing? Like, hey, would be nice to have a wizard, huh? Sorry, one give of that, them. Give me that one. scroll and let let me let me completely fumble on that roll. Um, <laughs> yeah. Ask uh, Zook. I think you're the. <clears throat> I think you're the only one who can uh, use this. Uh, I'll, not give him, anything. I'll, I'll give him. I'll give him the scroll. Um. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm reading the the description. Okay. Um, oh, okay. And it's a wisdom saving throw mm -hmm. with advantage if you guys are fighting, uh, fighting it. So at this point, with all, all, of, all that you did to him, you would have advantage. So it's up to you guys if you want to try it now or maybe wait. Uh, 
when you're not directly harming him. I think it's well, too late. You you gave Zook a scroll. Hold on. So. Well, well, yeah. Well, if, wait, wait. If we share me right now, it's not Duke. going to happen, and he is going to. All right, all right. Uh, that's enough, guys. That's enough. I mean, it's one thing to kill someone, torture them, but that's enough. And uh, Samad is going to use healing word level one. Wow. On the creature. I can use him... cure once again. It's not. Don't. Don't waste healing word. And uh, while he uses healing word on a creature, uh, you uh, you can tell us where uh, the black spider is. And uh, we'll let you go after. Um, okay. Uh, well, Brandon, that would yeah. be a deception, by the way. If, uh, if anything, <laughs> but I have to roll first for Illing Word. Yeah, he's not restrained uh, at this moment. I. Yeah. But so he's he surrounded. Can. He is. But and someone has to feet are cast. And both his feet are broken. Well, 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 well. you are healing. Cook uh, should uh, cast the. Uh, the, the charm person too at the same time because in, if not he's going to do something uh, for healing word it would have been six points up six yeah hey okay. right. so Samad cast his spells uh, it's picking in, like um, reforming a bit the foot, uh, healing the da some of the damage that you guys did on him. Um, so as you do that, you are also telling, asking him to uh, tell you uh, where is the black spider. Where's the black spider? So you can make your uh, deception check, also with advantage. So, since you're healing him, yay! Ever that ah! one fell down. I should have left. Uh, the, the deception, right? Oh my! What is this? Eleven. 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 Right. Scar person. <laughs> as you, uh, as you're telling that and healing him, um, he spits on the ground again, and he's not just spitting, like, pit. Like there's a chunk that falls on the ground. Oh. And you look at it, and you bit off his tongue <gasps> and there you go. out on the ground in front of you. Oh. That's, oh, that's, that's what asshole. he was doing when he was grinding. His that oh. asshole. Okay, quick question. Right now he's bleeding, right? And there's still acid working on him? Mm. Acid, no. No, no. no he's not bleeding are... anymore. Like, he, he's, uh, he's pretty much healed up uh, a bit. Okay. Um, there's no acid anymore because the acid was All removed right. by eating. Right. Uh, yeah. Uh, Kill the guy. Uh, yeah. We, uh, just, yeah. we did what we could. I think. I think at this point uh, we're not gonna get anything else out of this guy. Kate. And we cannot use charm person because he cannot talk. <laughs> you wanna do the honor? Or I do. Yeah, and as soon as he says you wanna do the honor, his head falls off. Kate, Wait, Kate, Kate didn't say a single fucking <laughs> word in 20 minutes. He's been waiting with his, his weapons like, 
<laughs> whenever. I just need a single moment. Just tell me. Just whenever, guys. Stop healing him. I already killed him once. I was like, what, what are we bringing back? Yeah, yeah what the hell, guys? I, uh, well, you can roll for your attack. Damn it. For attack or damage? Um, for attack. Attack. And that is 24. Wow. That definitely hit. hits. And uh, you can roll your damage. You can add your sneak attack. Cut the hit. <laughs> 19 damage. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. He's pretty much dead. Yep. So, <laughs> uh, with your rap rapier, you just purse his head. Um, like it, it just like sticks inside the, the the house wall, and he's just standing there, like his head pinned down to the wall, uh, expiring his last breath. Finally, after <laughs> being uh, tortured. <laughs> Yeah, well, after being, uh, not just, like, it's been two days, he's been killed and revived and killed and revived multiple times. It's Suffering. kind of, kind of impressive that he had an iron will like that, not gonna lie. So now what? Now we lost our last clue? I'll, uh, I'll go take care of the body. Okay. And, um, I'm, um, yeah, I don't think, no, we, it's not the last clue we have. I think we should be able to get more if we go back to, uh, the castle. To the castle. But we just yeah. came from there. Yeah. But maybe we can find some information. Because I think if the black spider is behind all of this and the death of Toblin, Toblin, no, Toblin, no, the other guy, Gurdon, Gurdon, so we have to go again. Now? No, we can take. We can sleep. Are we still bringing like a keg of beer? Yeah. Sounds like a uh, good idea. Maybe, maybe we should bring two this time. <laughs> Because, because it lasted you know, not even a day. Proper. Yeah. So yeah. It's a lot to carry. Definitely doable. It would be, it would be easier with a cart, definitely. Mm. We could bring we a cart. Get the cart again. Right. So, so what are you guys doing? Uh, uh, are we are, going... like, are you doing anything else I'm... tonight? I mean, or... I've heard someone talking about magical items. Kinda I'm going to check now. the body again. Maybe I can find some uh, mark. So you go Samad help uh, Samad bury the, the body. Yeah. While he's burying the body, I'm going to check the body. <laughs> but right. Yeah, yeah, do your thing. <laughs> I'm going to check. Make, a, make an investigation check. Make it one good roll for the whole thing. I think, yeah. 19 total. That's good. Um, so, as Simat is uh, digging the hole up and throwing the body in the hole, uh, you get the glance under the, his foot and there's a tattoo. And what is the tattoo? Like in Toy Story? Spider. Yeah. Is it in Marker? It's a black spider. <laughs> yeah. This was, this was the guy. <laughs> Working for. Working for the black spider. So I suppose he came from the castle? To be the... Be that the... No idea. I'm, I'm, I'm no making... idea. I'm just here for 
burying the body. I ho, I ho. In the hole you go. I ho, oh, I ho. I just helped him to just. Jesus. <laughs> That's a nice version of this name. That's burying body. So oh, bad, so bad. I helping him to bury to bury the body while I'm trying to figure out what is happening. But I I I trying to 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 to, to figure it out what is happening. Everything. Yeah. So yeah, we have to go back. Night. So I'd, I'd, say, I'd say you guys finish your work. Uh, the others, I guess, uh, take a table in the inn. Yep. The ruckus kind of calm down. Still smelling like uh, smoke inside. Nobody really knows what happened or that it's Zook's fault. Um, but yeah. So, uh, Tamara, you make your back. You make your way back with Samat uh, in the inn. Join the other at the table. Um, Toblin finally. <laughs> like, it, well, Toblin, the, the real one, is uh, in the inn. Uh, he kind of makes his way to your table. Hey! Wow, long time no see. Well, it's been a couple of days. Uh, it's been okay in the village. What are you guys up to? Like, what was that about? Well, we get in a fight with someone. Yeah, my and... inn almost uh, went up in flame. Uh, next time, please do it like a bit farther. I, I, I like, I like this place. I like it a lot. Um, yeah, every, lot everything happened so fast. Well, like, I, I assume, yeah, it I seems to that. happen quite a bit with, with, with you guys. Like, are you guys okay? Like, um, was it, was it rough? The usual. Yeah. A guy who transforms in you, and he tried to. How do you say yeah, that? It, wait, wait, what? Have you ever yeah. heard of a doppelganger? Double? Doppelganger? In, in, in double. fairy tale? In fairy tales? Um, I've never met one. Well, they exist. They are pretty real. And you met one? And he's turned into me? Oh, that's creepy. Yeah, why you? Do you think? Do you think he, he was spying on me? And so Should I be more. worried? I think Ooh. he was spying everyone because he transforms in Zelda too. Yeah. So. That's worrisome. Alright, you guys really look like you could use a good meal and some really strong beer. Let me bring that for you guys. And, um. Makes I'll, his I'll, way I'll to play, the kitchen. Uh, I, I give three gold to to Toblin. Oh, oh thank for you. the meal and for uh, the walls. She's the gonna burn walls. Sorry. <laughs> burn walls. The fire adds some cachet. To the <laughs> well, it's certainly gonna give me a story to tell the clients. And here's and, someone. Uh, he takes the gold, uh, go back uh, in in the kitchen. Soon comes back with a lot of beer, meat, stew, bread. Pretty good. Good. Food. Very, uh, very uh, welcome after your trip and everything you guys went through. So should we kill him just in case he's also a spy? <laughs> no. No, no. To Toblin is fine. Toblin is fine. I'm just checking. Ah, uh, uh, Toblin, this is our new friend. Name Zook. Zook. Zook Toblin. Toblin. Zook. You can nice, first. Nice to meet. Nice yeah. to meet you, Zook. I'm uh, not gonna answer because I just killed someone that looks like him, so I'm suspicious. But you know, it's Zook's gonna. It's just it just looks at you. Uh, 
So like, just give give it give it uh, give it a little of time. Stuck is trying to figure it out something. Yeah, I can understand. I think. Um, yeah. Alright, uh, uh, you guys enjoy. I'll, I'll be uh, at the counter or manning the, the table. So uh, if you need anything, just just tell me. Yeah, of course. And he moves away. So I think I'm going to end the meal and going to sleep because whoa, I spell, whoa, whoa, whoa. I spell hold slots. On, hold on, hold on, What? Um, what are your plans, Zook? Oh, uh, what? I mean, um, it seems like you could be a valuable companion if you want to travel with us on the long term. What are your goals? What are you doing? I'm following you because I think you you might you might go places interesting. Well, everything seems to lead to um, some place called uh, Mines of... Wavic Cave. Wavic Cave. Which I know of, right? I'm trying to remember, Kidia, what you told me, yeah. Well, you're... A deep gnome, so I mean, yeah, it's a cave. yeah, I know, I know about them. So, there is deep old magic you, there, you... and that's definitely something that I'd want to check. So, if you'll have me, I'll, I'll tag along. And as long as you, you guys stay strong, I'll, I'll tag along. Uh, okay, tomorrow, now, now would be the time for you to share. I think you're the one who has a staff. I think. Ooh, staff. okay. So I take a what staff from my bag <laughs> and I give it that to. This is from the bag. <laughs> from my Jeez. yeah. At the small bag. I get, enter get to my staff. slots and I take. So and what I... camera is? Yeah. I'm going to give you uh, a staff of defense. It's a, a crystal staff, a glass staff. Glass staff. Yeah. A glass staff. So, oh, so nice. yeah. So what Tamara is ending you is a very intricate uh, staff made entirely of glass with like some very well worked uh, like pummel at the end very pretty you look at it you touch it you feel instantly like the power coming out of it and, uh, yeah it's all right instantly picking your interest and you can add it oh, yeah. to your equipment it uh, calls a staff of defense staff of defense all right i'll add that it's pretty it's so cool, cool. Yeah. I'm gonna So hide. cool. I'm I'm not Zook's not that good to hide his emotions and right now he's ecstatic. Cause it is it is one of the first items that he's found as magical properties, except for, for his uh, Arcanite crystal. So yeah, the very old gnome that you see is gonna act like a kid the second you give him the staff right now. And... That's, oh my god. That's, that's all I'm gonna say. It's Christmas gift. It is. We have also. I'm not sure about that. Uh, I don't think Semat can cast Fireball, oh. right? He can absolutely not. Yeah. You, you, you. All the skull you found, no one could cast it before. There was only darkness, I think. Yes, and he used it. And he used it, yeah. And he used it. Yeah. And um. We would have also this scroll. Please use it wisely. It's a fireball. Well, I'll I'll take the scroll. And wait, am, I, am I wrong? It can't fireball scrolls can only be cast by wizards and. Uh... Druid? Is that it? Sorcerers, maybe? No, there's sorcerers. 
bit more. Bard, I think, and, too. And none of you can cast it? Nope. Hell yeah. All right, I'll take it. Fuck, oh, fuck. Yeah, it's Christmas. Right now, it's... uh. <laughs> yeah, Zook. It's just static. Uh, for the it's... record, I get back my manacles while I was uh, helping mm. Zemat. Since, to notice since that. Zook's a good guy, I'm going to remove my ropes and give them to you. In oh. A, in a really? nice gesture. Yeah. Thank you. I mean, whatever for any, it's not any necessary. kind of... Life. I... I'm going to buy it's too tomorrow late. more It's too rope. late. He stopped listening to you the moment he gave you the rope. Sorcerers, okay. wizard, light domain, the fiend, the genie, artillerist would be Jesus. the ones who can cast fireball. Engineer. So there Lawyers. is one type of cleric, but um, Semat is the arcana All right. cleric. Yeah. So All right, that's good. Domain. I'm just going to add then a fireball um, scroll. And just... Zuki is a wizard, right? He's not a sorcerer he, or... A... He is a, just a wizard, yeah. So, you can act... Like, you can uh, copy the scroll in your spellbook. Yes, I can. In some... Like, I think you need some money and stuff like that, and you need time and all that, but, like, instead of casting it once, you could also learn... Learn it. What, what's the level of the spell, of the fireball? Fireball is three, so I don't think you can do it for Fireball, but I think you can do it for the other one if you gave it to him. Did you give it both the charm and Fireball? He has a charm person, yeah. Charm so person is a fierce. Is, is I a, would have to uh, read it again, and you can do it, it too on Except, the I, I, I don't know for the charm, but Fireball is a vocation spell. If I'm not wrong, I can, I can learn one level above and takes... Uh, half the time to learn I'm trying okay. to just recheck that, that's cool i and uh, i don't know I'll, all the specifics i'll I'm check it out fine I'll come to you. that uh from a, sc a scroll you can learn it and copy it in your spell book that's good uh, you're gonna have fireball I, boys if i remember correctly charm person charm person is important yeah. you don't know when you need it. Who had the scroll? Who gave me the scroll? Is uh, it Simad? Simad gave you the scroll. All right. Okay. Still in his inventory. Oh. But he yeah, because he can't remove it. Yeah. It's fine because I I want to want to try and add it and I'm. Is that all we had? Out. As scroll? No, and no, stuff. as uh, stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you guys so. promised yeah. me so what much is, treasure. There's still <laughs> three things that you guys could, couldn't could do anything with. Yeah. Oh! These aren't magical, I could've helped out. No, I, I was saying like the staff and the two scrolls are mm. the three things that um, well, couldn't be used by... We, we don't have a, a grimoire from oh. Coast. <gasps> Stop it. You, you, but, uh, you have uh, the Necromancer spellbook, which I was supposed to give kind of the content to Semat, but uh, I think he forgot and I also forgot. It's fine. But Semat has uh, the Necromancer's spellbook somewhere. But I think is the, the Necromancer book is going to be more useful with Semat. Because he's a cleric. Might be true. Um, Oh, Maybe. Fair cannot, fair cannot learn spells from the spellbook. Fairy have access to all their spells as soon as they level up. Okay. They just need to prepare them. They don't need to learn them. So it's different. So, so I don't think Samat can do anything with that spellbook. But I wanted to put some information in it, like some scripture or stuff like that, but I, I forgot. So wizard but can't learn something from that book. There, um, yeah, I wanted to list a couple of uh, like low-level spell that would make sense in a spell book for for him. So, um, like raise on potential, potential. It's actually not, like, uh, yeah, it's a bit weird because he has he adds zombie, but he wasn't actually 
high level enough to raise them, but that's how it was uh, scripted. I don't know, it was weird, but I went with it. Um, so all that to say that Semat has a spell book, but like you can give it to him if you want, but for the content and the nitty gritty, we'll have to... Uh, uh, and uh, I also have this. He's gonna drop like... A, oh, it's, a, it's a mumbo jumbo. Right? Um, dang. He's going to fall, like... I'm trying going to fall. To I just, at the same time, I just put things in the inventory. Jesus. Okay. So you uh, you, you you take the grimoire. You just mm -hmm. like, turn some pages. Like mm -hmm. uh, it's all very uh, short and and very cryptic and like notes and stuff scribbled on. Like it's a uh, other person's spellbook. So it like at at like you understand that it's some. Um, magic and uh it, it has uh spells and stuff and notes and stuff in it but at a glance you don't understand much of it like you're gonna oh. have to spend Study time yeah. de decrypting it uh translating the spells copying them if you think they are useful and stuff like that so it's gonna take probably some time but like the, like the whole it, night is that something uh I'll, I'll have to figure out like how it's gonna, how long it's gonna take. But um, it, it's probably gonna be per spell, like some time to um, just figure out what the spells are, and then if you want to copy them, then it's gonna be the same rules as uh, the scrolls. So it's gonna take you some paper, uh, like the gold and the time that. It would usually take you to uh, put spells in your spell book. All right. Okay. I'll check these out. But um, but yeah, just looking at it, you're very excited. Like it's very clearly someone else spell book with uh, their own kind of knowledge on whatever arcane focus or arcane uh, school they were uh, following. Which, at a glance, you very clearly. The a, a tendency for necromancy. All right. All right. Interesting. You think you just made your? I think you just made your wizard a lot more fun to play. <laughs> All right. We pulls the wizard. Hmm, I got something real quick. For each level of the spell, the process takes two hours and costs. 50 gold pieces. 50 gold? Jesus. Yeah, magic paper is expensive. And ink. Like, you need special special ink and special paper. I mean, I have that. Oh, no, I just you have another ink. Yeah. Well, I have one sheet of parchment. You might uh... have some. But um, you, you should have a gold value next to it if it's the right stuff. But you also have a feat that halves all that. For, evo for, for, for evocation. For evocation spell, yeah. For yeah. Uh, but that's mostly necromancy, though. Probably. Well, I mean, it's still level one, so it's going to be... Uh, I'll, but you I'll need 50 gold out, for the start. paper? Yeah. Okay. We're going to have to go well, to the line shield costume. Ink and paper. I forgot to ask, how much gold do usually people start with? That's the one thing I didn't check. Dep Ten. Depends on your background. Oh, uh, yeah, my background's poor. All right, okay, so but, I'm poor. Uh, Don't worry, we you're... can do some something. No. It depends on your background, but like <laughs> well... 10 gold is when you're level one. So uh, I don't know exactly. Uh, you oh. would probably have a bit, a bit more since you yeah. started at level three. Yeah, but you have... You... The rest of the group uh, gathered quite a bit of gold, so I don't know. If they're I, gonna I, I would help like you to give it. I I'm going to give you fifty gold for buy for you're going to learn one of the 
one of the spells? I yeah, I have Tamara yeah. watching out for me. Hell so yeah, let's go. I give you, I give you fifty gold. But I mean, that. right for the conversation, like I don't think it would go that deep into like you're gonna mm -hmm. need paper to translate. Like you're just receiving everything and like looking at it and like not not thinking already that time. Yeah, yeah. You're you're going to like translate everything and like do all all that so uh you you, you guys can do it in the future when, when it comes up but all right okay i, I think at this okay, point makes sense. I, it yeah, yeah doesn't yeah. really make sense for tara to also throw gold at zook okay, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. What a, what a throw items was. throw books scroll gold would it would it make sense for me to have at least 10 gold pieces yeah, yeah. I just realized I have one, so I'm I'm ultra poor. No, ten is, is what you would call it. Yeah. According that we, I have uh, yeah. twenty platinum. Yeah. Oh Jesus! Yeah, I'm gonna put myself at ten gold. Twenty platinum for what? Uh, total. Don't worry, we, we're going to loot that gold. Oh, okay. Total. You guys. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, not me. I thought. Yeah. I thought no, you no. meant like if you start level three. You get no, no. 20 platinum. <laughs> 20 no, no, no. platinum, there you go. Did you want money? Here is money. We're going to loot right. that castle. Uh, wait, definitely. For the other campaign, we started at level, what, six? Please. Yep. And we had 100 gold to start with. Yep. Yeah. The level six have just you have. That, that was all gold. I had. Was going to say. Take 25 gold. 25 gold? Boom. Yeah. GM as chosen. All right. Can I invest it in Dogecoin? How's that work? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the stock market is pretty, like, <laughs> pretty flat right now. All right. I, in, I, in I, all I don't have in my inventory right now is the the grimoire you just gave me i'm gonna check that afterward but otherwise like you just you, love i think you, i think you can add something like just by writing it down in your inventory oh yeah i'll do that I'll, that's gonna be a whole lot simpler uh, custom item because because like you you won't you won't be able to add like a grimoire in other positions. It, it's good it's gonna be custom anyway so you okay. can just write it write it down in right now that you have a this is interesting. I have usable paper for one side. What? What? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and in on uh, one side. Yeah, because I was taking letters or or something in a in the in the other house, uh, and I I was taking paper too, so I can give that to to Sook. For you? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. I don't remember. Like, um, well, I have paper. I, I think it, it's a, it's a. Uh, how do how do they call it? Um, when it's a component, like oh. it's considered as a component. It has a gold value. So okay, you have okay. like paper component, like fifty gold, and then okay. when you have that much. You can do whatever you're using. You're usually doing. Okay, and I get it. And also something to keep in mind, so I'm pretty yeah. sure changing your familiar form costs like something like 200 gold of incense or something like that. Changing my familiar? Oh, that's the why. Form. That's why you have to use always the same familiar the the, the form oh the i didn't read familiar. that are you sh why are you familiar oh. as an action you, you can temporarily dismiss your familiar disappear into a pocket dimension alternatively you can dismiss it forever as an action while it's temporarily dismissed you can cause it to reappear in any occupied unoccupied space 130 feet of you i don't i don't see the cost there but I didn't read about a, lot, a whole lot about familiars. Well, I don't know exactly where it says it, but uh, let me 
See, so, when the Felmir drops oh, zero hit oh, sorry, I'm sorry, you, you go ahead. No, it's ten, oh, okay. It's ten, ten gold piece. I thought it was more than that. But to cast Fine Familiar, it's oh, is ten it? gold pieces of charcoal, incense, and herbs consumed by fire. Ten gold it's pieces. In the, it's in the yeah. components. You're so right, so. you're right. I just saw that. Thank but, you, I didn't see it. And casting but, time is one hour. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so I think that's, that's when, why. Like, that's when it dies or... Uh, Makes sense. When it dies or something, if I want to call it back, I need these things. Yeah. Okay. Okay, good to know. I guess we're stuck with the owl for now. 1d1 okay. damage, that's all I'll say. The next is going to be so, a prep. So you guys are sharing those stuff, doing a conversation, eating your food, drinking your beer. Um, anything else? you want to discuss or um, you guys are heading to bed yep yep, yep. all right yep. so for the sake of it i think you go see dublin you ask for rooms you pay for your rooms um i don't remember how much it was i don't know if tamara you were considering it as part of your tree gold um, i think yes I remember okay. it's not that expensive. Yeah, it's not that it's expensive. just like... Like five silver or something. Like five, five silver. Yeah. I'm going five to give silver, him five cool. silver for the... Well, yeah, ten silver. Yeah, in is not that expensive. Yeah. Like, uh, like I, I, I don't remember exactly how much, but I think it's like a, a normal person to live for a year. It's like ten gold piece. Yeah, well, okay. we never pay... That, like so. you guys are like adventurer like when you have like 5,000 gold piece and you buy like a magic item like it's it's pretty much like someone that has a, like half a million dollars or something like that. why buy magic items when you can buy the inn just, <laughs> just buy the inn well, the, the, the inn is not gonna protect you if you want to keep Earning gold and yeah, adventure. That's a good point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to give a uh, ten silver gold just uh, for pay for someone else and me, who whatever wants and ouch. And yeah, that's let's, it, let's just say uh, the three gold is, is fine. And you guys get okay. your, your rooms. Uh, you're lucky there's no one else because there's six room now. You're thick, basically. But you're fine. No, you're fine. You're fine. Uh, we're fine. We're fine. So there's. Unless Sildor uh, still lives. No, I think he, he has something. Yeah. 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 You guys are fine. So you, you get your rooms. Uh, yeah. It's getting pretty late. Uh, even though you you uh, you wake up pretty early uh, so happened a lot in the day so a lot of walking because head back to bed um, and yeah lock We're the door and end it here for tonight I think unless you're gonna yep. yeah. to keep going no nope, would be fine I yeah we can we can I plan good I just I just, yeah, I just want to say something. I'm going to bring the owl inside and uh, I'm going to read the book. I don't want to sleep. There is Zook's not going to sleep. He has something new to play with. And he's going to yeah. he's gonna try to do his thing with the book. And then we can add it. I'm, I'm like, before the we end the stream. Did you, want, we end did the, you say you want to bring the owl inside? Yeah, I need someone. Yeah, that's it. He's inside, just where you moved it. There you go. <laughs> but the owl is not a giant owl? That's my question. Or is it's a, not. It's not a. It's one. not a fiend. I actually had the choice between beast. Uh, I had choices. I well, don't remember what they are. Normal owl. It's, it's a right normal now, owl. It's a normal owl. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. That have more sense. It's just a. It's, it's it's big, but when you know when he's sleeping and everything, he's fine. Okay. It's cozy. Because I was imagining a giant owl enter. 
Yeah. He needs a bed also. Could it? Its own room. Yeah. yeah. Almost doesn't fit in the frame of the door. So you just go to the innkeeper. Do you have about half a ton of uh, birdseed? What? Yeah, I need half a ton of it, please. I'll I'll eat meat. Oh, that's oh, he's full. Yeah, he's he full. Ate, he ate oh, the foot, he was uh, eating the Oh yeah. yeah, he's good. He's good. <laughs> well, we we try. Yeah. All right. We try that's to check in the right. guy. Yep, next week we're going to be yeah. able to plan uh, what's next with uh, Samantha, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Because we're going to check the castle so he can do his, uh, his thing with the shrine. Look what's behind the big no no door. The big, big no no door. door. <laughs> Another door. Oh. Can't see. Because I think there's a lot of things that we miss in that castle. Yeah. All that for a dead dwarf. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Shit happen. You guys are really, really <laughs> unlucky on those roll. Yeah. I know, right? We we can save the the guy. Um. Uh, in 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 some point of the of the of everything that happens. Uh, this, uh, how do you call it? I forget Gurdon? the name. Gurdon. We can save Gurdon, like, he can leave, or uh, was just, there wasn't wow. any choice, he have to die. No, no. You guys could absolutely have saved him. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we, we, multiple, multiple, multiple yeah, yeah okay. we tried, we saved him, we did save him so many times. But at the end, we can't do it. Yeah, there was a lot, a lot of things like happening that mm. made make made it to that point where it got killed. A lot okay. of different roles, different moving parts. Uh, okay. But yeah, you guys could definitely have killed, um, uh, not killed, but saved Gurdon and be safe with him. You guys could also like. Uh, you guys could also have got some information of, of the the poking. Hey, everything he is possible. His, his, his tongue, like, how did well, you go into dog? At some point, like, it's like you're you're trying multiple times the same thing. Like, at some point, it needs to have uh, some consequence to yeah. The, yeah. The, the failure. A lot of bad rolls. Yeah. Well, we try. We're going mm. to see what happens. All right. Yeah. But All I, right. I mean, there's uh, there's still multiple ways you guys can uh, get to the end of it. Okay. That's that's the beauty of it. So don't, cool. don't think yeah. you lo like you lost everything. It's... We have to do something with that dice. Use the Zook way. To burn everything. Buy your dice. That always works. It's a it's yeah. a foolproof plan. Hey. <laughs> but he did say he completed his mission. Hey. You got that. You got that out of him. Yeah, which oh, yeah. was killing yeah. Gurdon probably. <laughs> yeah. Probably. Probably. But man. Oh well. Well, thank you guys. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, and, guys. And thank you. It was cool, so I, 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 yeah. knew you were, I knew you where it was gonna go. And to be <laughs> honest, like, that's really not what I had in mind. Uh, really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, well, we have a chance to figure it out next week. Yeah. yeah. Mark. Thank you very much, guys. Bye bye. All right. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. Bye bye.